My name is Matt Lee Sester. I'm the Emergency Management Coordinator for Chesapeake Regional Healthcare in Chesapeake, Virginia. My role and responsibility here is kind of all, all things emergency preparedness. So whether it's hospital incident command, whether it's emergency operations planning, um, you know, mass communication during an emergency, uh, all of those types of things fall under my purview. You know, we were kind of in a severe weather uh, watch. And as the day progressed, you started seeing more and more tornado warnings popping up in the areas kind of as the storm was tracking towards us. And we took our CAP inbound messaging. So we set it up to have um, the National Weather Service alert when, when and if we got a tornado warning. Uh, we geofenced around the hospital. So we, at the time, we did it as a 10 mile radius around the hospital. If we got a National Weather Service tornado warning, that that tornado warning polygon clipped that that radius, it was automatically going to go in and say, okay, cool. Sent me a text message and an email to say National Weather Service tornado warning, and then immediately turn around. It turned around and automatically activated our tornado warning alert within Brave Alert and sent that out to staff automatically. The average uh, time from uh, receiving a tornado warning to the time that tornado touches down is about nine minutes. It literally took four seconds from the time the National Weather Service alert came through to go out and send the staff. And that's 4,400 4, contacts, I think is what it went to. I look at that as a, as a huge win for us because that gave my staff here an opportunity to have eight minutes and 56 more seconds of preparation time to get in safe spots, make sure people are out of the hallways that can get out, get them away from windows, do all those types of things that if I lost four minutes waiting for an alert to go through, now I got five minutes on average. So that was a huge win for us. It did exactly what I wanted it to do. And I never, I never had to log in. The operators never had to log in. Nobody had to go in and send out something to say, hey, there's a tornado warning right now it immediately went out and did its job. So I, I can't be I can't be any happier with how that worked for us.